When we think of medieval plagues, the Black Death usually comes to mind first. But this week, we'll be discussing a very different kind of plague. Our topic this week seeks to answer the question that everyone seems to be asking these days, namely, did entire villages really dance themselves to death in the Middle Ages? So we'll be exploring what the sources say happened during the dancing plagues of medieval Europe and what may have caused this odd phenomenon. Anyway, sources tell us that there were numerous incidents when in Middle Ages Europe, uncontrollable dancing began, usually with one individual, and then spread like infectious disease. One such incident happened in 1518 in the Holy Roman Empire, where a woman started dancing uncontrollably. You are the queen. People in her village began dancing uncontrollably as well. The dancing in this case lasted for several months. In another instance in southern Italy, a woman began dancing after claiming she had been bitten by a tarantula. A tarantula! Again, members of her village began to uncontrollably dance, as if they had caught something from her. These cases of unstoppable dancing periodically racked regions of medieval Europe. Worse, Many were attended by dozens or even reportedly hundreds of fatalities, with people apparently dancing themselves to death, expiring by either heart attacks or strokes. While odd and tragic, there is only speculation as to the possible causes of the dancing plagues phenomenon. What is that? As to the causes, some experts think the dancing plagues could be a product of psychedelic bacteria that sometimes inhabit grain. The most popular opinion, however, is that the dancing plagues were cases of mass hysteria brought on by psychological stress. All in all, the dancing plagues remain a great example of unexplained historical phenomena. <laughs> <laughs>